Hi guys, welcome to Play Corner. Um, today I wanted to show you Amari's learning folder. Um, I saw this about a week ago on YouTube and really wanted to make one. Um, there's two ways that you can make one. You can either download the printables, um, normally there's a charge associated, or you can make your own. I made my own. Partly it's because some of the pages that were relevant to America aren't relevant to the UK. There's currency, they call autumn, fall, we don't. The spelling of colour is slightly different. Um, and I also wanted the flexibility of being able to change pages. And when you purchase a printable, it normally says, please do not alter. So I don't like to get involved in that copyright stuff. So make my own. If you would like a tutorial on how I make the worksheets, um, then leave a comment below and I will get that sorted ASAP. Okay, so learning folder. The first page, well the outside, is laminated as well. So Amari's currently learning how to write his name. Um, it's a good opportunity for him to practice. Um, we've only just completed this folder today, so he hasn't had much use of it yet. Um, but towards the end of the video, I will get him to play with it so that you guys can see it in action. Um, he thinks it's a toy. So it's great for me. He thinks it's a toy, it's reinforcing learning and it gives me five minutes break. Okay, so we have colours. You peel off red, green, yellow. When reprinting, I'm going to make this slightly more orange. He thought it was yellowy. So um, he's my biggest critique. We also, being based in the UK, there isn't the availability of clear Velcro um, as easily available in America, so I've had to settle for white. Um, then we move on to shapes. So we have square, triangle, heart, rectangle, circle, and star. Um, next we have some sorting. Same shapes, two different colors. Um, even with Amari pulling off the Velcro himself, um, it isn't always guaranteed that he's going to get the answer right, so it's not been a problem so far. Um, on some egg matching, uh, different size eggs, different colours, um, helps with just a bit of awareness. Then we have counting, 1 to 10, with some number recognition. On to some nature matching. We have a counting exercise. Um, Amari spotted an error. He counted the tigers. There were five. I had four. Um, I will just delete one. That is the benefit of making your own sheets. If you make an error, you can just edit it and fix it. Um, if he finds a sheet too easy, easy, I can make the animal slightly smaller and increase the value. Um, onto some shape matching again, but with all the penguins the same, so it's definitely about the shapes and less about the colours. Uh, we have pattern copying. Now, Amari's really good at copying patterns, um, which was great. He found this page quite easy. But then we move on to what comes next in the pattern, and that wasn't very strong. So, again, having made the sheet myself, I can increase the number of pattern copying, pattern matching, um, and what comes next in the pattern exercises for him, very simply, because I already had the template. Then we have some counting of oranges to go in their relevant boxes, up to five. Again, once you can do this exercise easily, make the boxes slightly smaller or add another page that goes up to 10 or even 20. We have uppercase and lowercase matching dinosaur egg to the dinosaur. And that goes all the way to Z. With a little thank you note. Um, onto some counting. So we have one apple, seven candies, two carrots, eight broccolis, five peppers, etc., etc. We have matching the letters again, lowercase. Mario's quite good at his uppercase recognition, not so much his lowercase, particularly D's and P's and B's and Q's. So that's definitely um, something that we can continue to work on. Um, a small introduction to phonics. Um, he found this page quite easy. So again, I can add more pages that are similar, slightly more advanced, um, increase his um, phonic 
um, development. So we have A for alligator, F for elephant, I for igloo, and R for octopus. Some more matching. Um, this is colours again, but slightly different. Um, he spoke about the shapes that are inside of the squares, which was quite interesting. Um, some more matching with ice cream cones. We have upper and lowercase, as just mentioned, um, is something that we are definitely working on with Amari. So I've added quite a few pages that help reinforce that. We have senses. This was something that we did find benefit with today very quickly. So very early on, um, he understood the concept of seeing with his eyes, touching with his hands, hearing with his ears, smelling with his nose and tasting with his mouth. This page was a page that I saw in a learning folder of an American um, vlogger and autumn was written as fall so it made so much sense for me to make my own um, and again if you'd like a tutorial on how to make worksheets very quickly and simply um, even if you're not very arts and craftsy I'm definitely not so it wasn't difficult at all um, and it felt quite nice to be able to provide him with something that's educational um, we are working on the days of the week um, he's not yet understanding the pattern, um, what become, what comes after, what comes before, but we used it as opportunity to work on phonics. So when we were looking at Tuesday and Thursday, he, were getting, he was getting the two confused. As you notice, they're not coloured, so it's not a colour matching exercise, um, it's the word. And for Tuesday, I helped to emphasise the s of Tuesday and the r of Thursday, and that helped him to differentiate between the two. But more work on that. And again, with the months of the year, we, I don't believe he's actually looked at this page yet. Um, by this point, he's going to be like, oh, okay, no more mummy. Um, and then we have a clock face. Now, I haven't included hands in this page because Mari isn't yet at the stage of being, I don't even know if he understands the idea of a clock. So it was to begin to introduce it to him. Uh, once he's able to do this exercise very easily, then we can move on to what time does this clock say and what time does that clock say? And this hand does this and that hand does that. So the folder can grow with him. Um, I think that's enough of me talking. So um, so you guys can see it in action. Um, I'll get Mari to come and you guys can watch him complete some of the activities. Really appreciate um, any comments and any feedback on it this is all very new to me so um, I'd appreciate some feedback and again if you have any comments if you would like a tutorial if you'd like a copy of the printables more than happy to provide that um, just leave a comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe so Ma you're going to do the learning folder for all your friends yeah. good boy okay so what's this one you got them. Mummy, take them off for you. Thank you. You're welcome. They go here. It does. I don't fit. Go here. Yeah, but can you make sure the writing's the right way around? Would you mind? Can go right here. Yeah, but the writing's not the right way around. Boy. Thank you. Good boy. Oh. I know. That's all right. Good boy. Good boy. And yellow. And yellow. Good boy. Well done. Good job. Let's do another one. Let's do another one. Ooh. Ooh. We've got some shapes. Yeah, shapes. Yeah, shapes. Oh, good pulling. Okay. The heart. The heart. Yeah. Yes, that's a heart. And a blue circle. A blue circle. And a rectangle. Rectangle. Oh. Hmm. I don't think that's right. Square. Square. 
the go here. Yep, triangle. The star goes here. The star goes there, that's right. Even then, though it's upside down. The rectangle right goes up here. The rectangle goes there. Good boy. Let's try the double one. Let's try another one. Ooh. Ooh, what do we have here? What do we have here? Oh, 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 okay. Do that cocoa here. Correct. Do you remember what this one's called? Um, Arrow. Arrow. Mm -hmm. Do you remember what that one's called? Um, Rectangle. Mm, that's a rectangle. This one's a triangle. Triangle. Yeah, a triangle. What is it now? A triangle. Yes, it's a triangle. Good boy. Well done. Uh, oh, I go here. I mean, yeah, it's kind of overly. Yep. A rectangle. Yep. Okay. This An arrow. Arrow. An arrow. Good boy. Ooh, what do we have here? Eggs. We have eggs. Good boy. I did it. You did. You pulled them all off. Can you put them back on? Purple go here. That's right. The blue go here. That's right. Oopsie. Oopsie daisy. Oopsie daisy. Here. It does. Oh no, I... Oh no, mummy will laminate that one again for you. Don't worry, mummy fix it. I know. Oh, it goes here. It does. It goes here. It does. It goes here. Excellent. Ooh, Ooh. what are these? Bobby. Numbers. Numbers. You're going to play this game? Yes. Go on then. Let's go here. That's right. Did two go here? Oh, you want to do them in order. Okay. Two goes there. That's right. The three goes here. It does. The four goes here. It does. Fly go here. That's good boy. No, no, I go here. Okay, so we're not doing orders anymore. Six, eight. Go here. It does, Mom. It, it brings on. It says we go here. Yep. And then go here. It does. I did nine go. That's not a nine. Do your numbers for me. Say them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Good boy. Six. Yeah. It does. Well done. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. What do we have, Ma? Um. What do we have here? What's this? Oh, you're still pulling them off. What's this? Yeah, it's a tree. And what's this one? What's this one? It's called an acorn. Yes, please. Would you mind doing an activity for me? Yes. The tree goes there. The tree goes there, that's right. There's another tree. Hmm, maybe it's this one. Yes! It was. What next? Acorn. Acorn, good boy. That's right, it's an acorn. Good boy. Well done. Next. Leaf. Yes, go here. It does, Mum. Go here. And this is called a flower. Flower go here. Flower go here. That's right. Well done. What do we have next? Ooh. Ooh. 
Ooh, we can't do this one. We can. We ignore this line. Do the other three lines for mommy. Okay. Do these ones. How many alligators do we have? One, two. Two. Me too. I don't know. Oh, that's number two. Good boy. And how many monkeys do we have? One. One. Good job. That one, my That's monkey. right. And how many elephants do we have? One, two, three. Three? Wow. Good boy. Ooh. Ooh. What are these? It shapes, that's right. And what animal is this? A penguin. It's a penguin, that's right, Ma. Ooh. All right, are you ready? Dad got. Oh, Dad Yeah. That's right, the star goes there. What's wrong? They come out of music. It's okay, but It's okay, Bobby. It's okay. You're doing these really fast. You know what shapes this is? What shape is that one? Triangle. Why do you keep calling it a triangle? Oh, no, that's a triangle, yeah. But what shape was this one? Rectangle. That's a rectangle. This one is a square. Square. So again, that's something that we can work on, right? We can look at the difference between a square and a rectangle. Keep going. This is a hard one. No, you're almost finished. This is a hard one. Can you do the last two for me and then you can move on? Oh no! All done. See, that wasn't very hard. Wow, what is this? I, um, I don't know. It's called a pattern. I call it a pattern. Yeah, that's right, it's a pattern. So what I need you to do, I need you to copy the pattern. So what do we start with? Frog. A frog. Good boy. Oh, yeah. And what comes after the frog? Wolf. Fish. A fish. Good job. And then what comes after the fish? A frog. A frog. Good boy. A frog. Fish. Another fish. Again. Okay, you want to move on? Mummy help you. <laughs> You're very lucky to be getting some help, isn't it? Why does that go there? Is that the same? No. No, it's not, is it? So where does that go instead? Go here. That's right, it does. Mouse. It's a mouse. Good boy. Apple. What's an apple? Apple go here. And the bird goes here. Oh yeah, that's a bird. Why do you call it an apple? What's the, that? The monkey goes here. The monkey goes there. I'm making bird. Making a monkey. Did you drop one? Yes. Sir. You did. Yes. Mummy, find it out later. Don't worry. Oh, what comes next in the pattern? Okay, mummy help you. You gonna listen? You ready? Yes. Frog. Fish, frog, fish, frog, fish, frog. What comes next? A frog. But you've got a frog here. Do that again. Frog. Fish, frog, fish, frog, fish, frog. What comes here? What should be here? It be frog. But that's a frog. What comes after the frog? The fish. The fish. Good boy. That's right. Thank you. You are very welcome. So we try this one now. Are you ready? Yes. Say it. Kite. Teddy bear. Kite. Teddy bear. What comes after the kite? What comes after the teddy bear? Teddy bear. That's a teddy bear. So teddy bear. A kite. And a kite. Good boy. Ooh. Well done. Hey, that's not the right line, is it? 
Good boy. Okay. This one's a little bit harder. Are you ready? Bird. Mouth. Maggie. Bed. Mouth. Bed. Mouse. Bed. Monkey. No, almost. Try that again. Bird. Mouse. Monkey. Bird. Mouse. Monkey. Bird. Mouse. Good boy. Well done. Now, Mummy realised that you don't exactly know the different balls, so we're going to go by colour. We have orange, white, brown, orange, white, brown, orange, white, brown. White, brown. Good boy. But we only need one. Well done, Ma. That was excellent. Ooh, we've got some oranges. Okay. Yum, 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 yum. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Right, so, how many oranges do I want in here? One. One, that's right. One, guys. Yeah. Good boy. And how many oranges? I don't, oranges. Oh, no, you dropped one. I'm going to get it. You're going to get it? Yes. Yes. You got it? Is it an orange? No, it was the monkey from the last page. <laughs> there you go. All right, sit back down for me. How many oranges do we want in this box? Two. Two, that's right. So we have one and two. Good boy. And how many oranges do we want in this box? Three. One, I need you to count them. Two. Three. Three. And how many in this box? Four. Now I need you to count them. One. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Four. Four. Good boy. Now how many do I would, would I like in this Five. box? Five. One. One. Two. Mm-hmm. Three. That's right. Oh, four. Oh, you lost one again? Oh, Mummy's going to have to find that. We're missing one, aren't we? Yeah. Okay. Now, we can do this one, but I want to move on because I need to show. No, nope, we did one very similar to this a moment ago. Ooh. Oh, no, we did one very similar to this also. Ooh. Let's move on to this one quickly. Ooh. All right, mister. So, what is this, please? Okay. Alligator. Good boy. Now, what sound does alligator begin with? Apple. Good boy. So, what letter is that? Show me. A. Good boy. There you go. Break. Now, what animal is this? Elephant. And what sound does it begin with? No, not what sound does it make. What sound does it begin with? What letter sound? What is it? I. I for is it eh eh elephant? Yes. No, that's not right. It's eh eh elephant. So what letter is it? Show me. Eh, 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 no, darling. We'll move on to this one. What is this? Eh, okay. And what letter is it? Oh. Good boy. And what letter is that? Show me. Good boy. Thank you. Now what is this one? And what letter is it? Show me. Yeah. And which letter is it on these? Yes. Well done. What, so what letter is that? Yeah, I. It's an I. Well done. I got here. Good boy. Now we'll go back to this one. What is this? A F. And what letter is it? Eh. And what letter is that in here? These three. Is it an I? Is it I? Or E? E. I. Or E? E. E. So which one's E? Echo here. Good boy. Because it's an mm. elephant. Can you say e elephant? E-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-e-
My eyes. Your eyes. Well done. So there's your eyes. Right. What do you use to smell? My food. Smell. Yeah, you smell your food. But what do you, what, what do you use? Do you use your nose? Do you use your ears? Do you use your hands? Which one do you use? Uh, my hands. Your hands to do what? My, my nose. Your nose. Good boy. Oh, your nose is upside down. <coughs> well done. What do you use to hear? My ears. Your ears. Good boy. Right. What do you use to touch? Huh? My mummy. You touch mummy. What do you use to touch mummy? My hands. Your hands. Right. You're very welcome. And what do you use to taste your food? My mouth. Your mouth. Well done. And they are your five senses. Yes. That's right. Ooh. Okay, so this is also new today, but let's try. Right, mister? Yeah. So, yeah. we have four pictures. Listen to me. Yes. We'll do one at a time. In the winter, it is very cold. Yeah. Which box is w winter? Thank you. In the autumn, it is very rainy. Autumn. Thank you. Okay, now this is where it gets really hard. In the summer, in the summer, okay. we go to the beach. In the summer, which one's summer? Summer. Good boy. Ooh, thank and in the spring, spring, the butterflies come out to play. I got here. Well done, it does. And they are your four seasons. Okay, no, that was the end. We just wanted to give a taster of the learning book. There's some activities you haven't yet tried, and there's some. Oh, we can do one more actually. I know you quite like it, so we can have a go. No, not the mumps. We haven't looked at that one yet, mister. We'll have to discuss those first. Okay, now these are the days of the week. Okay, are you listening to me? Yeah. Right, okay, so mm, Monday. Monday. Now, what sound does it begin with? Ma, ma, ma. So, where does Monday go? Monday. Okay, I'm going to give you another word. Where does f, f, Friday? F. Friday go here. Friday here. Take Friday. Where does it go? Show me. Right here. Good boy. W w Wednesday. Wednesday go here. Thank you. Right. Oh, you did it wrong. You didn't. Got to look what you're doing. W Wednesday. Give it to me. W Wednesday goes where? Look at the words. W. Which one's W? Right here. Does that begin with W? No, go here. Thank you. Good boy. Next we have sat today. Sat. Show me. Saturday. Sat today. It's an S. It's an S. Good boy. Now this is Sunday. Saturday goes here. It does. Now, okay. Let's have a go. This is Tuesday. 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 Let's do it that way around. Thursday. Where's a r? Show me a r sound. What letter makes r? Rabbit. Rabbit. And what letter's rabbit? Rabbit, rabbit. rabbit begins with uh, uh. an R. Can you see an R? Find me an R. A little R. Uh, yes. So that's Thursday then, isn't it? Yeah. Good boy. And then Tuesday. Yeah, well done. That is excellent. Ooh. Good boy. And that is our learning folder, mister. Thank you to watch Bye. Bye.